edition of High School Rewind, available on highschoolrewind.com and the High School Rewind YouTube channel. We are at East High School, home of the Leopards, as East welcomes in their region rival, the Highland Rams. Thank you for joining us, everyone. Dane Stewart here to bring you today's game. Really fun game on hand for you here today. We mentioned a rivalry between Highland and East. It's well known in all sports. East has won this rivalry in boys soccer for the last seven years. They're going to try to maintain that streak here today. Let's start by introducing the visiting Highland Rams as a team that comes in 0-1 and 1 in region play, 1-4 and 1 overall. And uh, it's a team that's really trying to find some answers. They've been plagued by some inconsistent play. They have a new key for them. Uh, starting just his second game back there is going to be Patrick Miles, the junior, taking over as keep. He was a defender. Coach Coyman saying had to move him to keep, so he's learning on the job. Never fun to do, but going to be key for this Highland Rams squad. Miles have a big game because this East offensive attack can really put up some, some goals quickly. They're coming off a nice 2-1 victory over Woods Cross East. 2-1 now after falling down 0-1 in region play. Yet they've given up the first goal in every match in region play. The East Leopards have something that Coach Shank, I'm sure, would love to have them correct. He's going to have an opportunity to here today. That 2-1 victory, goals from Oliveira and Christensen. Christensen did a nice job really attacking the net. Got one that was deflected in off Woods Cross. That was the game winner. But it's a balanced attack for East. Guys like Eves Govina leads the way. They have four other their kids with three goals apiece. The offense is very balanced for East. It's been very good all year long. They hope that that continues here today. Meanwhile, the Highland Rams, they scored three goals against uh, in their most recent contest, a draw against Box Elder. So maybe the offense being found now for the Rams. going to be interesting as uh, this rivalry heads to the pitch here at East High School. The Rams and the Leopards coming up next here on High School Rewind. East will kick off and start with the possession. Oliver, I mentioned, had one of the goals in their win earlier this week against Woods Cross. Midfielder and also a name to bring up Daniel Rondo back for the East Leopards. He gets the start up at the wing. Good for East to get him back. It's a team that had sat, has had some injuries this season already. And an opportunity early developing for Barker, and that shot deflected away. Coming up, that shot just wide of the net. A great, great look from Oliveira. We'll have a kick coming up for Highland. Boy, an absolute rocket from Oliveira. Just wide. And that time, I think Miles is probably breathing a sigh of relief. That was just in the first minute. That ball couldn't be controlled and turned over. And Highland now with an opportunity as they'll give it right back. Midfield with Holbert. He'll push it outside with Garta. Far side, Rondo able to control it at midfield. Nice move there. Holbert tried to send one up to Barker. Defended well by Highland's Daniel Garcia. Ball still in the defensive third for Highland. As they'll bring it near side with Gutierrez. Ball turned over as Morgan able to settle it. Pass was deflected and back to Hill and the defense of the Leopards. Cardenas play this ball outside. Nice spacing here by the Leopards as Oliveira plays a ball up. Rondo's going to try to get there. Don't think he'll be able to keep it in. No, he won't. We'll have a throw in for the Rams. Throw in, headed up. Ramadi, touch that over. Maybe a familiar name. Kazra Ramadi for Highland is this ball down. And an opportunity maybe developing for Miranda. Boy, great job just taking that ball away by Govina. Deflected away by Miranda and East to throw in. Off the throw in. Ball touched up. Was looking to go to the inside. Barker was trying to go outside. Is that ball able to skip over the head of Argueta? Garta. 
Has some help. Over tried to play it back. Now Highland with a possession near midfield. Bahameen drops to the defense. And you see Govina putting pressure on as Highland just had to play the ball out. Thrown in and a great challenge put on by Gutierrez, able to clear that ball out. Though so East trying to keep the possession at midfield. Good job by Jacobs. Using his teammates, Hill up in support. Barker tried to touch one up to Govina. He won't be able to track it down. Another kick coming up for the Highland Keep. Garcia comes off for Highland. Andrew Rivera comes on. His debut in this ball game as we are wrapping up our fifth minute. That ball well out in front of any ram, and East will let that roll. And a kick coming up. It's a refreshing drink. Elders, the and kick. Down to the south end of the field. Able to be headed out by Highlands Arqueta. Up to Holbert. Space closed down on. Plays this ball up ahead. A couple East players there. Barker as well as Rondo. Ball was two out in front of their runs. Miles, able to get the ball up to midfield. Holbert, good job coming back and taking that ball away. Pass from Rondo, deflected, sticking with it. Highland was looking for a call there. Nothing coming from our official. Played outside, you see Miles come up. Hill, excuse me. Holbert, challenge put on there and a kick awarded to East. Nice job by Holbert using that speed to create an opportunity. Govina and that kick off the target and they say deflected and we'll have a corner kick coming up. Barker from the corner. Good ball headed out immediately by Gutierrez. And a kick, another kick coming up here for East. As it was Oliveira drawing the foul. Oliveira from 35 yards out, gonna fire one on net. Miles able to catch that one easily. But good job keeping that ball in play for Highland. Now up ahead. Miranda with it, near side. He's collapsing down defensively and it's Holbert that comes away with it. He's gonna play one up to Barker. Highland has numbers back as Barker lets that one roll to him on the run. Barker in the box. And Highland able to take it away from him. The defense of Josh Christensen, the captain was ready. They come back with Barker. From the corner, Barker in the box, and that shot low and shallow of the net. Miles kick right to Holbert. Scovina touches over to Jacobs again. Back with Cardenas, and immediately back to Thomas Morgan, one of the captains. Up ahead, beautiful ball to Barker. Trying to chip one over, and what a save put on by Miles. He just punched that one over the crossbar. And another corner coming up. Another leopard corner low. And that shot deflected from Govina. He was really trying to lay some wood on that one. A couple Rams able to deflect it. It never got through. Is coming out with it is Ordeñez Taylor, the senior. Looking for some help. Just taps that one up ahead to his help. And now maybe an opportunity is coming out to pick it up. That time is Elders, and a good read there is just beyond the Highland offensive player. I think it was Ordeñez Taylor again. Booming kick from Elders all the way back down. Barker trying to track it down, and he's going to get it to Govina. Eves bringing it into the box. 
And that ball was too long as he tried to cross it over. Holbert to track it down. We'll get there and keep it in. Great job by Eric Holbert. Help. And that shot was missed by Rondo. Make a note of that one. Rondo's not a kid to miss that shot. He would love to have that one back. Was setting up for the one-timer and just didn't hit it squarely. Near side now with Hill. Morgan. Oliveira couldn't keep it. Look at Rondo come back and put some pressure on the ball, deflected it out. Highland will throw in. Vroom in the box, headed up. Morgan, Govina, still in the box. Want to get it out, and they will. Ball punched up back ahead, and there's Garta. And then Oliveira's had enough of this. It's Finally able to get out of the defensive third, and Barker knocked down. No call from our official. Holbert taking on three Rams and finding help, and Barker up ahead to Rondo if he can get there. Miles coming out. As he'll just kick that ball out of play. Barker. Ball kicked out by the defense, another corner. Highland able to evade the attempt as it will bounce out. Garto was trying to get it in the box with Rondo. Holbert came up. Highland trying to clear it out. Estrada comes off for Highland. Is Garcia back on? A whistle here and kick for Highland coming up. Argueta to take the kick. And that ball over everyone's head and a kick coming up. And substitutions on for East. Hammond and Rodriguez both come on for the Leopards. As we wrap up the 15th minute here, still no score between Highland and East. One of the better rivalries in the entire state, regardless of sports. It's near side with Hammond, tried to fire one up, and that ball deflected up high by Gutierrez. Another ball from Hammond deflected. Highland with a chance to maybe create an opportunity here. Bahamin, ball punched up ahead. And couldn't get there, East to throw in. Garcia played up ahead. Ordenez Taylor back. Ball served up in the box, headed out, but still in there. And that ball may have been deflected. Now they'll say a goal kick instead. Elijah Strait comes on for the Rams. East there defensively. Nice job. A couple of nice moves put on by Cardenas. A sophomore had the game winner against Ogden and showing some fancy footwork here against the Rams as he has it back again. One of the center backs. Morgan plays up. Rondo at midfield looking for help and good tackle. There's a the ball played out by Gutierrez. That ball headed right up to Barker. Barker maybe with a chance, and boy, he just pushed that one too far out in front of him. It was a great recognition by Hill coming up off the throw in to head it up to Barker. Barker just let that one ricochet off his foot a little too strong. Now Highland maybe with a chance to put a bit of a counter on. It's here straight. Tried to center, it was a great idea, but no one home and the ball cleared out by Garta. Straight, able to throw in, he'll get it back near side. 
Trying to center, ball deflected up in the air. Jacobs heads it up and then out by Oliveira. Highland D up in support, trying to get it back in the box as this one will bounce out and Elders to kick. Luis Estrada back on for the Rams. As this ball played to the defense for East. Approaching the midway point here in this first half. Still scoreless. Couple opportunities for the Leopards. Highland has been close on some opportunities, but just been a little out of position as run put on and then turned over. And up ahead with Rondo. Barker just pushed off the ball. Our official says nothing wrong with that. Is back with the defense now and Morgan. Played back to Elders to just clear that ball out for the time being. Talking with Coach Coyman, he said the very thing. They've just been out of position a few times and it's been costly to them in the early goings of this season. We've seen that a couple times here early. Opportunities and men out of position. This one in position, maybe a chance to fire and there's Gar to, to block it away. Ball not out, Elders will pick it up off the hop. A kick coming up, great job by Garta. That's his job, being the defender. Not letting that shot get through as we have reached the midway point. 20 minutes into this first half. Barker. And pushed down and finally a whistle from our official is wondering what he did wrong with Gutierrez. Cardenas. Headed out by Highland. And in fairness to Gutierrez, I don't know that it was so much wondering what he did wrong. There was a good level of physicality down there and maybe wondering what led to the call against him as opposed to against Barker as this ball from Elders will make it all the way down to Miles. Ball settled by East at midfield. Hammond playing it up ahead to himself, opportunity to center. Barker with it, and then cleared out by Gutierrez. Another really good chance if Barker had just another half second. Oliveira plays to Rondo, and straight there to take it away and play it out. Christensen comes on for Rondo. Mentioned Rondo back. He's been out the last couple games. Surely want to manage his minutes a little bit here. Jacobs plays over to Hill. Hill looking for service, and Hammond headed it, but it was deflected by Argueta immediately and out of play, and East to throw in. Hammond throws in to box, <laughs> excuse me, to Barker in the box. Again deflected away. Garta, Hill, has men up his left side. It's where he's going to go with it to Christensen. Christensen in the box. Opportunity to center, and Barker missed the one-timer. He tried to left it and just didn't hit it squarely. Again, another prime opportunity for the Leopards. Hill sizes this kick up. Arts near side, Morgan. And that ball too far out in front of Oliveira. Rodriguez played it back to Garta. Barker now tries to chip it up ahead. Ball played out by Highland. Brandis Smith comes on for East. Barker again in the box. That ball deflected away and a goal kick, I believe, will come up. Yes, it will. Ball played up. Trying to get there and doing so was straight. 
Ramadi able to center. Good challenge put on there as this ball took a bounce and Hammond, like a bolt of energy, came up to help deflect it away. Garta, Oliveira controlling at midfield. Playing the ball up, Hammond trying to get there. Miles will just come up and kick that out of play. Barker trying to get a lane. Has one. Centering. Christensen headed back and off the crossbar again. Still in the box and missing on the one-timer and then cleared out. Patrick Miles has a new best friend. It's the crossbar. Saving him again. Rondo just came on for Barker. He plays this up to Hammond. Hammond trying to get there. Miles will pick it up. Kick. Headed back up by Christensen. Cleared out by the defense. Highland with the ball at midfield. Coming out with it. The Rams, an opportunity, good run put on here by Bahameen. Mentioned had the two goals. Is that ball deflected out? Bahameen to throw in, in the box. Cardenas able to play it out immediately. Garta coming over, and then it's Cardenas able to clear it out finally. And now an opportunity for Christensen, chipping it up ahead. The defense, if he can get there, he won't be able to, and it's Christensen able to kick it out. And then Miles able to get there and keep the ball in play as opposed to giving up the corner. A little behind the support, able to cross it over now to Bahamin. Space being closed down on. Still with it from about 30 yards out. Straight tried to center it. Morgan now to clear it out. Estrada looking near side with Straight. Was trying to head it back to his support in Bahamin, but couldn't get there. Christensen will track this down and now space up the line for Christensen, centering it. Rondo going to try to get there. Miles comes out and another big play by Patrick Miles going to the ground and securing that ball as Rondo nearly able to get there. East with a fury of activity going on right now in the offensive end. Have not been able to solve Patrick Miles or to figure out how to beat him yet. Far side. Highland with an opportunity to counter. In the box, this ball crossed over to straight and saved, not by Elders, but by his defense. It's Morgan who comes back on the weak side of the goal to kick that one out. And a big play there early to keep us scoreless here as we wrap up the 30th minute. Ball played ahead, Hammond, not with the same burst of energy. He has expended a lot of it here in the last five or 10 minutes. Though he'll get it back. Try to center it to Rondo and the ball deflected. Will eventually roll out. Govina and Ortega both come on for East. Govina heads this to Ortega. Far line. Couldn't secure it. And goal kick coming up. Cardenas track this down in the defensive third. Boy, ball nearly won away. Ortega coming back on the helm. The ball deflected away. The throw in eventually controlled by Ordenius Taylor. Trying to get it up to straight. Hill is back and straight kicks that ball out. Christensen, nice job staying with that. Thought that he had help up. 
Jacobs Govina nearly has that one bounce to him. He'll come over and gather it. Help coming up for Govina. He's looking the way of Rondo and deflected away by Rivera for the Rams. And then that ball out off of East. Vroom to throw in. Ortega able to clear it out, but does so. Right to Gutierrez. Coming near side, straight. Straight trying to cross it in the box, and it's too far out in front of Room. Ball brought in the box, evading a couple leopards, pushed over, and that one time or deflected away by Christensen. As Ortega will play this ball out in a Highland corner coming up. Estrada will take this corner for the Rams, the first one of the contest, headed out. Back to Estrada. And now the ball cleared out, but not out of trouble. And eventually our official sees the flag was up. Highland offsides on the play, 35th minute complete. Still scoreless here from East High School. Smith played that back, looking up ahead. If Ortega can get there, can't outrun the defense, but he'll win it away in the short term. Good recovery put on there by Ramadi for the Rams. Estrada throw in, well beyond everyone as Cardenas able to clear it out for the time being. Gutierrez at midfield. Nice recognition. That ball played in the box, no one there. Thought they may have had Ordenez Taylor with some space. Instead it will be Elders now to kick this back in play for the Leopards. Gutierrez. Hill heads it back up as straight hit the turf, able to get up. Estrada came away with it. Ball played up, looking the way of Govina. A little behind him. It's cleared out by the defense of Josh Christensen. Olivas comes back on for East as our first half drawing to a close. Govina with good ball handling. Rondo in the box, the fire, and it's blocked away once again by Christensen and then cleared out and a kick coming up here for Highland. Miles from just outside the box, takes a bounce. Trying to get there is Vroom, he will not be able to. 38 minutes complete here at East High School. No more time updates for the first half as that takes a hop, settled down by Highland, played up the line, Vroom tried to get there, couldn't. Garta throws in, Rondo. Bahamin, trying to get it to straight. It's too far out in front of him as Hill will let that roll out. Hill had that ball taken away. Flag up and a kick coming up here for Highland late in the half. Estrada will take this kick from 37 yards going on net and Elders easily able to track that and catch it out of the air. Christensen had that one hop over him and he'll be whistled there for the foul. Miles kick, punched away, nice job there by Rodriguez. And with that, we've got halftime here from East High School. Couple great opportunities for the Leopards. Miles up to the task, we're still tied up, zero apiece. Second half underway. The Rams to start with the possession. Still knotted up. 
zeros apiece. A couple really good opportunities by the Leopards. Big saves and some help from the medal have kept Highland tied up in this one. They had a good opportunity themselves. It was one that was kicked out by Thomas Morgan as Highland able to get this ball down to the offensive third, but quickly taken away by the Leopards as Holbert with it now. Sends one up. Rondo's going to try to get there. Though Ramadi will play it back to Miles. Ramadi able to get away before he was closed down on, though. Turned it right over. Oliveira. And a throw in for East. Guard to, to throw in, and he stepped in the field of play. Ramadi is throwing, headed up. Rondo centering to Oliveira. Outside, Govina trying to step through the Rams, able to get it to Barker. Now Govina to fire that ball in the back of the net. Ives Govina is the man from 21 yards out. The Leopards take the lead in the 42nd minute. Govina with the goal and a beautiful shot from just beyond the box. Breaks our scoreless tie. The Leopards with the lead and we mentioned in our lead that High, or East had given up the first goal in all three of their first region contests. That will end the streak there. Govina in the 42nd. Thrown in to Barker, letting this one hop and cleared out easily by Estrada. It's chasing this one back is Morgan. Plays it into space, is straight able to step up and head it up, though couldn't find a teammate. Hill will drop this back to Cardenas and his defense. Holbert plays it over to Oliveira. He ends up turning the possession over. Pushed outside, stepping up his room. Try to play that up to his teammate, and it was Holbert that stepped right in front of it. Vroom sticking with it, able to regain the possession. Near side now for the Rams. Ordinez Taylor, service in the box, headed out by Hill, and Govina now with it on that far line. Touched it past one Highland Ram, past another, and an opportunity for East. Players running down, Barker, his center was deflected, and then eventually kicked out by Bahamin. Barker, what a nice move to create some space. Tried to serve one up for Rondo and couldn't get it to him. Throwing a little behind Rondo. He's trying to track it down, able to touch it into the box, but no one there for East as Cardenas comes up in support. Only Vera couldn't win that ball. Garta nearly able to get it. As Highland able to clear it out for the time being. Jacobs up ahead to Rondo. As that ball's out and he's to throw in. Garta throws in up the line. Barker will get there and then wisely play it off of Ramadi. Great job by Barker winning the corner for East. Saw a lot of corners for East in the first 10, 15 minutes. Another opportunity for Barker here. That's a beautiful one. Headed in by Rondo. <laughs> Welcome back, Daniel Rondo, in the 46th minute. Off the corner from Barker, and it's 2 0 East. Boy, great response from the East Leopards to start this second half after 40 minutes of scoreless soccer. Two goals in the first six minutes of this second half. Take a 2-0 lead. Rondo with it here. Trying to play a ball up for Govina, though he won't be able to get the run through, and Miles will gather it off the turf. Jacob sizing it up and heading it right back. Now he will drop it back to Morgan. Govina 
couldn't keep that ball in play. Oliveira up ahead. No leopard there. It's Christensen trying to play this ball up. Hill came over, couldn't keep it in play. Ball thrown into the box. Cardenas couldn't get it out. Settled. Garta eventually would get it out of the box, though Highland still with an opportunity to settle and get a shot on, although that one rests with a bunch of white shirts and tapped out by Highland. Thrown in. Barker trying to head it up. Rondo, the clearing attempt by Ramadi was deflected off of him, will end up with Highland, and now the Rams almost with an opportunity to counter as Jacobs will squash that opportunity and let the ball bounce all the way down to Miles. Headed back to Hill. As help, he will drop this all the way back to Elders, the keep. He kicked it up, but right to the chest of Bahamin. And that time, good recognition by Highland, realizing they were offsides, couldn't do anything with it. Hill with a nice move of the ball there. Well, Highland still with had an opportunity until cleared out by Govina. Opportunity to counter. Holbert with it. Played the ball up. Over to Barker in the box. Barker couldn't get a shot away. The Highland defense up to the task and able to clear it away. Garta, space, will drop this back to Elders as he calls out his defense. Over to Morgan. A lot of space for Thomas Morgan. Govina, far side, time and space in front of him. Has a man outside, it's Barker, it's where he goes with it. Barker has Rondo and Govina in the box, centers to Govina, and that would be good in football, but it's not good in football. Boy, another great opportunity for the Leopards in the 50th minute. Sails over the top by Govina. And these are the East Leopards that many people thought would have an opportunity to get back to a state championship game this season. Seeing aggressive play offensively, solid play defensively. Challenge at midfield, and it's Jacobs. He will play that ball up over the head. Barker trying to track it down. He will get there. Has Rondo in the box. Barker, how about using the speed? Rondo had that one just a touch behind him. Govina able to settle at 19 yards out. Will drop it to Holbert. His shot deflected. The follow-up from Rondo and another one that skies too high and wide. Holbert headed one up. Rondo. Able to get the deflection into the box. Miles to gather. This kick. Hill sees that off his foot. Ball touched right back for Highland. Now centered. Ball played up. And a little too beyond Miranda as elders will gather. It's a good idea right, right there by the Rams. Haven't seen them try to go over the top of East very much. And East with a lot of speed. Balls behind the tarp. Finally dug out. Barker, space in front of him. Plays over to Rondo from the box. And a beautiful tackle put on by Christensen. The senior captain has been stellar, and Rondo is still down. And this is not a good sign. Rondo mentioned his injury, and it's down in that area he was holding as East will come out to see how their senior is doing. Rondo had to be helped off. The trainers will look at him, and you hope for East it's nothing severe. He's Adds another dynamic to this offensive attack for the Leopards. Garta able to play that ball up. Ramadi settles it for Highland. A little behind Miranda as Govina comes out with it at midfield. Play this back to Hill. 
in support. Jacobs drops it to Cardenas. Christensen played the ball up. Govina. Boy, nearly one-on-one, -on -one, and it's Christensen again able to deflect that ball away, and Christensen has been stellar in a corner coming up now for the Leopards. 56 minutes complete. Barker calling out the set. It's low. Holbert will drop it back to him. That ball fired, and Miles able to knock that away. Good save from the junior keep. And just his second game in net for the Rams. Hill throws into Govina. And a foul on the play and a kick coming up for the Rams in their own box. Miles kick, chested down by Garcia. Played up ahead, nice move by Miranda, trying to win the line. Played it up ahead, Jesse, as East will play that ball out and allow the defense to recover. Miranda throws in for the Rams. It's touched back to him. Service in the box and over the head of the intended target was trying to get it to Argueta. Garcia. Hill able to head it out. And Govina now centered to Holbert. Ball batted around and Christensen got spun around. Otherwise, East may have had another opportunity developing. Ball well over the head of Miranda, and that will go out. Hammond, as well as Julio Martinez, both come on. Hammond, a sophomore, Martinez, a freshman. So Coach Shank with an opportunity to get some youth, some added experience here. And push from behind, and eventually the call will come. It was Martinez, the aforementioned freshman, drawing the whistle. Cardenas to take this kick straight 50 yards away. And ball's in the box, headed just, well, well wide. Looked a little closer than it was, and a goal kick coming up for Highland. Kick, headed around, challenge, and it's Garta coming away with it. Loud Rodriguez to pick it up, and now dropped back to Cardenas. Jacobs was ran over. That ball will roll out and Highland to throw in. Highland able to settle, though the ball won immediately by East, played up ahead to Barker, out in front of him. As Miles will direct it out of the box. Good challenge put on by Hammond. He's not giving up that easily. Christensen and Christensen. <laughs> Played that ball away, and then Barker couldn't settle it. Nice job by Highland, able to get this ball into the offensive end, but Elders will come up and clear it out. Garcia at midfield looking to play that ball up. Couldn't get the pass through. And now it's Barker with it far side. Has Christensen with him. Barker to fire, a low shot, deflected away. Christensen able to track it down. But couldn't gather possession, and Scott Christensen taken down, and our official let's play continue on. As the ball will be deflected away and throw in for Highland coming up. Hill was able to get ahead on it, then Morgan to clear. And again, it will be Barker trying to track this one down. Christensen back. Barker with a bit of an edge. Spin move in the box, has Christensen inside and he will watch that one roll out in another corner now awarded to the Leopards. Barker from the corner in the 63rd. Boy, that had a great, great hook on it. Punched out by Miles. And a throw in coming up for East. All cleared out by Highland. Headed back up by Morgan. And boy, he, he took something right to the face. A nasty collision. Our official will blow this dead. And Morgan in pain right now on the turf. Allow things to reset here. Good to see Morgan okay. He was 
in a lot of pain. Took a pretty direct hit right to the head. And you hope for the Leopards again. Injuries have ruled the year to a bit. And a couple more here today. That shot was put on by Nick Stanger. Had a goal in their last game against Box Elder. Slow roller that Elders was able to clear down. Ramadi will touch that back. You see East again putting on that pressure. Aggressive offensively. Stanger wanted to send that ball up on a run and it got past Garta, but Highland couldn't control it. Plays it back. That time Hammond called for the foul. Gutierrez will take this kick. Shy of the box. Stinger was able to get a head on it, and it's punched and kept out again. Elders came out of the net to play it. Highland had an opportunity to chip it over him, and I think it was Cardenas able to keep that one from going in. And tell you what, Elders has been good today in net, but saves from Morgan and I believe now Cardenas on what were two nearly surefire goals for the Rams. Oliveira, we've got a whistle, another kick coming up for Highland. Another kick, this one sent directly on frame and Elders will catch that. Starting to see a little bit of chippiness in this one. We saw Christensen, whom that was targeted for. A Ram throw in infraction, so East now to throw in. And I'll finish that thought, Christensen a little while ago, a few minutes ago, didn't like the physicality in the box. Made it well known. And then on that last free kick, we saw East also not liking some of the physicality of the Rams as a kick coming up here for Highland. Ball kicked right to East at midfield. Smith tried to play that outside to Ozuna. Couldn't get it to him. That run broken up well by Hill. Govina trying to track it down. Christensen will get it out of Govina's way, though. Heads it right to a leopard. A nice job by Highland winning that away and clearing it out of the defensive third. Hill will backtrack, has help. Ball works to Cardenas. Boy, nice step up. Stinger was coming on strong. Garta centers to Ozuna. Ozuna creating a lane, the left-footed shot deflected and then cleared away by Rivera. It's Rodriguez with it far side. Ball settled down by Martinez. Govina, he's going to fire and that shot is wide of the net. This kick will get down to the defense of East. Will they give it to Stanger? Ball kept in play by Bahamin. Stanger and a foul here, and we're going to get a card. I, Well, no, we won't. We'll get a warning here for East. And, yes, we will get a card. It'll be Holbert picking up the yellow. Estrada will take this kick. Far side of the box. Stanger tried to bicycle it and missed it in the process as Olivas will clear that out. Down to Josh Christensen, the captain for Highland. He's going to try to send one right back up. Ball settled. Outside, Bahamin will fire, and a good save by Elders that time, punching it away, setting up a Ram corner. The corner from Bahamin. Nearly a shot. But about five Leopards in the way, able to deflect it. And it never got to Elders. And now an opportunity for Govina. He's got wheels, one-on-one -on -one with Christensen. Can he get him? Nope, Christensen, a great tackle to play that ball out. Thrown in to Barker. Touched right back. 
And Levis, I believe, had that one taken away, and Highland to throw in. Ardenas Taylor had that one out off him. Gutierrez stepped up to kick that one away, though. Now space for Smith as he tried to send one up to Ozuna. A couple leopards there, and it's Smith coming away with it. Govina around Gutierrez. Govina, the left-footed shot deflected. Ozuna trying to settle it. Barker coming up, and that shot just high. Had a nasty sink behind it, but not quite enough. There's a corner coming up now for the Leopards. Zuna will take the corner. Gets it into Barker, tries to touch it back to him. Nice cycling there, just passes it right back. Ozuna was off, and Highland will get the kick. Stanger. Couldn't control that. Ozuna tripped up. We're through 75. Barker will take this kick, fired right into the wall. As Barker will come back and gather, has help at center field as he will give it to Garta. Garta plays up and beyond everyone as Miles will pick this up, kick it down the field as our 76th minute expires. A pair of goals in the 42nd and 46th for East from Govina and from Rondo. Ozuna with it. Pushes this outside, good recognition. Seeing Olivas out there. Challenge, Olivas comes away with it. He's gonna try to drop it back to Oliveira. We'll get there. Govina, and not quite enough on that one is coming back was Miranda to win that and he'll kick it out off east. Isaac Jacobs comes on for east. Hill settles, drops this back. He'll pick it back up. Looking to get it to Ozuna. So he saw it go over his head, nearly turned over in the box, but headed out instead by Gutierrez. Highland trying to get it out. Stanger will clear that one away. Elders comes out put off the run of Highland. 78 complete here. As are our time updates. Garta near side. Quickly able to drop that back to the help of his defense. Highland not giving up in this one. Stanger, boy, pushed over by Jacobs. Jacobs not happy with him. And another card coming up here. And I think it will be to Jacobs. Estrada takes this kick, gets into the box, and then cleared out by Oliveira. Oliveira able to head it back up again. Olivas comes back, but couldn't keep the possession. But he'll win it there. Stop sticking with it, playing the position. Hill. Lost it. A couple challenges between he and Rodriguez representing East as they come away with it. And that ball deflected out and Highland to throw in. Thrown in up the line to Bahamin. It's marked by Hill. Island tried to give it back to him. Bit of a wall pass, though. Couldn't connect it. And there's our final whistle. The East Leopards, after a couple missed opportunities in the first half, two quick goals in the second half, defeating the Highland Rams 2-0 here at home.
Again, our final score here from East High School, the East Leopards 2-0 victors over the Highland Rams. An interesting game this was, the first half, you know, a rivalry game, Highland near the bottom of the region standings, but throw that out there when you're talking about East Highland, regardless of sport, a lot of pride on the line in this one here today, and the Rams played a really nice first half. East came out really aggressive. We saw a lot of attacking in the offensive end for the East Leopards. They welcomed Daniel Rondo back. That was big for East. We'll get to that in a little bit, but the combination of he and Barker really put a lot of pressure early on on this Highland defense. They were up to the task. We mentioned in the broadcast only the second game starting for their keep, that being Patrick Miles. He made a couple nice saves. He got some nice help as well as in that first half. Talk about the nice saves, we'll show you this one. Punching it up and over the crossbar. Great start for the junior keep here for Highland. And then a little late in that first half, a beautiful opportunity, the header just off the crossbar. We mentioned the help. Miles was okay in net today. The help surely helped him out. We were tied up after the first half to the second half we would go and it would not take long for this offensive attack of the East Leopards to continue that pressure and find success. Eves Govina from about 21 yards out, a rocket of a shot past Miles. It's 1-0 East. Then just a few minutes later in the 46th, off the corner, this is how you draw it up, folks. Barker and it's Rondo heading it in. B-E-A, beautiful. The Leopards with a 2-0 lead here in the 46th. That offensive pressure would continue, though they would not find any other goals in this one. They kept pressure on that Highland defense. Speaking of Highland defense, a lot of credit to Josh Christensen, the senior captain, one of the captains for this Highland squad. He was great on that back line for Highland, did a great job of really thwarting off a few of the runs put on, a couple of the services, as East had a couple opportunities for one-on-ones or uh, rushes, counters, and Christensen was back, able to defend it well. He had a good game at uh, center back for the Rams, but they would fall short here today. 2-0 to the East Leopards behind goals from Govina as well as Rondo. It's come time for us to announce our man of the match. We mentioned a little earlier Daniel Rondo returning from an injury. He is our man of the match. His first game back, he gets the second goal. It was a big one. He would leave a little later with an injury. Hope that he's going to be okay, as does the East High Leopards, as uh, we mentioned that attack of Rondo and Barker. Well, that's going to be a formidable match for this region and for 4A. This East offense looks so much more explosive with them up front in those striker positions. But Rondo, congratulations to him as our man of the match. We want to thank you for joining us on this edition of High School Rewind. For Vince Francis, my name is Dane Stewart. It's been our privilege to bring it to you. We look forward to seeing you here next time on High School Rewind.